Yo, what's up and welcome back. Today, we are looking at some dope little, and I mean little, Lego puzzles. Look at the size of these things. They're so tiny. We've got a whole bunch of them from Cheat3, another YouTuber. They build, assemble, and basically create these sequential discovery puzzles made entirely of Lego. And they also, I think they sell them. I got these boxes that they sent me, but they also show you how to build them with all the parts and everything involved. It's such a cool hobby. Everybody's got Lego somewhere. And if you don't, you can find them at a yard sale and you can create really cool puzzles. So, you know, you don't have to break the bank in order to make something super unique and creative, which I love. I love this idea. So check out Cheat3 below. I left a link to their channel. We're going to look at all of these puzzles except one. And I'll tell you why in a second. So these puzzles basically are tiny little puzzles and you have to find the money. There's like a little Lego hundred dollar bill. And this is the only tool that you can use. And so, all of them involve a few moves and then you reveal the money. This one actually comes with a little key, different type of puzzle, and we're going to look at that as well. Lastly, and now how many of these? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So like eight of these puzzles we'll be solving today. And lastly, we have a puzzle that I will not attempt today. It's got CR right there, as you can see in the clear blocks. This is the hardest puzzle that they have. This is a level 10, very, very difficult sequential discovery puzzle. Looks simple, but a lot going on on the inside. If you guys want to see that, leave a like, comment below. We might be able to uh, make an entire video for this one because I, I definitely think this is going to take me a lot of time compared to these ones. So there you go. Also, quick note, cards are shipping as of today or tomorrow. Uh, the cards are starting to ship out. So I know a lot of you uh, ordered them in hopes of getting them in December. Uh, we had a lot of delays with current situation of the world. If you guys want to help support the channel, buy some playing cards, buy some merch. We got this coming out as well. A little card porn series, which will be dope. Everything's shipping out now. Now, so we're good to go. All right, without any further ado, like, subscribe. Let's get into solving these Lego puzzles. All right, so here we are. Um, I know I made a short about these videos, uh, about these, sorry, these puzzles a while back, but I only um, showed a few of them off and I wanted to sort of show you everything that I received. Uh, Cheat3 has his own YouTube channel where he sells a lot of these things like on his site and whatnot, but it also shows you how to build really cool Lego puzzles. And I think Lego is one of the best tools to make a puzzle. Like if you're not into 3D printing, you don't have a 3D printer, honestly buying Legos and just messing around with stuff is a great way to learn how to make these sequential discovery puzzles. And you can discover a lot of new uh, ways to solve these puzzles. So the one thing about these certain ones, I don't know about this one, but I know about the rest of them is that you're given a tool, these little bars that are on the top. Those are the tools. Those are the only tool you'll need uh, to solve these puzzles. So we'll do them one at a time. We'll start with this one here. Give you guys a quick glance. And normally, like you see this little red square, like normally those are going to be able to be pushed in. So this we're allowed to take off. Okay. And so we're going to try and push that. That won't go in over here. Oh, see this? This actually gets pushed out here. Ah that green that's what we're looking for we're looking for the money we're looking for the money we go this way this is a little tricky Hmm. So I feel like this slides in, but at a certain point while pushing this one up, I'll try that. Not at all. I think the red is a red herring. So these slide all the way this way, all the way this way, or one at a time. <laughs> it's really tricky. Something just wiggled in here. Oh, got it. So there's the money. It doesn't actually fully come out, but all you need to do is have it to come out that much. So what happens is that there's something on the inside here. Uh, if I push this, yeah, now that's stuck. So there's actually something on the inside preventing that from coming out. Oh, and then you got to push it in. Hmm. 
Oh, okay. So this little green one here, if I push it all the way in, it's it can freely move. I just have no way of pushing it because on this side, it's actually blocked. Like I can't access that. So what's gonna happen is on the inside, there's a piece that actually comes in between. No, nope, missed it. Maybe it's like this. There it is. So now it lodged in there. And so when I slide this back and now push it back open, the bill is shown. That's the first one. So very clever, incredibly clever, uh, yet very simple. So that's one. Dang, that actually took me quite a while. Uh, this one here. All right, we got this moving block in the middle, which seems to get stuck somehow. There's the money right there. Uh, we got our tool. We got a few openings. Okay. Okay, that goes all the way through here. Oops. Mm. You gotta be careful because they do fall apart. So that's right there, but something's blocking me from pushing that. So I'm guessing I have to push something out of the way first. Oh. Aha, uh -huh. now perhaps. Yes, there we go. So it's just a little simple move here that I had to do. Basically, I, I oh, let's get that back into place. Ugh. This goes back in there. So basically these two move together. I had to move just this one out of the way. And there's something in there blocking that. And once I moved that one out of the way, I was able to push it through. So that's two. Very cool. Next up. All right, money's there. Easy enough. Oh, hello. Oh, that goes back. Okay. Oh, there we go. That one was a lot easier than I thought. Yeah, see it's blocked, but if I push all of this out and then push the top one back in, now shoo, the money would come out and there's your prize. Cool, another one done, that's three down. Let's do the next one. Oh, this one's cool. All right, there's the bill. That's what we're trying to get out here. And basically we just start by moving things around to see if anything actually moves. This thing here. Oh, it's spring loaded. Okay, so what if we spring load and then push? Spring load and push on the other side. Ah, okay. There's some openings now. There we go. Push something aside there, which then locks it into place. Whoa. And then that comes out. Back to square one, All right? So lock it into place, lock it into place. Hit that, which blocks that. Push that out. Still trying to find a way. That goes out. Nothing. Oh, 
Okay, that push that back in, then that springs back into place. Does that... Oh, it's still obstructed. There's still something in the way here. How do I get that out of the way? This is going to click it back. Nope. Oh, now we got it. Wait, what? All right, start again. That locks there. I think I blocked something. I'm not sure what I did here. Uh, I think I might have messed it up. Oh, I think I got it now. Yeah, there we go. And there's the bill. So this one was a little bit more complicated with the spring action. I'm not actually sure how the mechanics worked on the inside there. Oh, it was that back one. Because something was blocking that back there. So I had to actually push that out of the way to reveal the bill that's there. Okay. Four done. All right, let's go. Ooh, this is cool. Blue on one side, yellow on the other. We got the bill there. Let's start with the yellow. That doesn't move in. Oh. Oh, now there's a pink step. Oh, now they're all out. This one has to move out of the way for me to get that bill. Weird. Oh, I see a little gap in there, but it's not enough to get to the other side. This one has to go in to get out of the way for me to have access. How do I do that? Like this? Ah, got it. That's supposed to be it. Yeah, that should be it. Boom. So it's a bit of a sequential thing here where you push one in and the other one pushes the other one. See if I had this one through, that one now blocks it. If I move this out of the way, it pushes this one through, which is now blocked. So the idea is there. <laughs> what a cool little solution. That is really dope. There's another one solved. I love these so much. Little fidget toys too. All right, this one. I think I've done this one. Um, okay. Bill's there. Nothing pushes. Oh, here we go. That pushes in. It doesn't come out anywhere. There's something blocking that. This wants to wiggle, but nothing else is moving right now. Oh, there we go. That moved out of the way. And we're still being blocked by a red thing to get to the other side of that green one. So now I move that out of the way and there we go. The opening is cleared. Shoot, come on. There he is. Dooms. There's a hundred dollar bill. Neato. Another one down. Last tiny one. This one's cool too. Which one's my tool? Wait, does this one even need a tool? I think so. 
Not that. Oh, I guess I got no tool with this one. No, that's not possible. Yeah, these are all legit parts. I can't take these off. Okay. Oh. Oh, cool. What the hell? Okay, that moves to the side. Very cool. The slide out. That slides open here. Okay. That slides over. That slides, that slides, and there's a bill. Whoa, that is so cool. Yo, let's go backwards here. That is cool. It's got like a Rubik's Cube feel to it. So boom. So it's supposed to slide back and in. Okay, so from the top, back over, over. Come on. Uh, down, over, and there it is. Great little sequence to get that uh, to get that prize. I love this one a lot. My probably my favorite one so far. Wow, super cool. Okay, let's move on to these guys here. Uh, this one has a key, which I'm really intrigued by. So I'm guessing I got to take that key. It does get stuck on something there? I'm not actually turning anything here. Oh, it pulls. Okay. All right. All right. Oh. These sides are just sunken in. That goes up. Oh, wow. Okay, what does that do now that's up? Does that go, just push that back in? This here, maybe? I feel like this is where this needs to go. It's being held back by something still. Oh, it actually has the letter CR down there. I don't know if you can see that. There's an R, there's a CR. So that moves like that, but why would that move like that? There's some type of access down here. Oh wait, if I pull this up and now I use the key onto here and turn it, there's a wheel turning. Look at that on the inside. There's a wheel turning on there. That is so cool. The wheel's not really doing anything. Why else would that lift? Huh. The wheel's not really doing anything right now, so that's gotta get out of the way. That's got to lift up. Maybe I push that one back in. This here on the corner seems to want to move as well. Oh, there we go. Boom. That slides open. Thank you very much. We'll grab that key back. Oh, that's what that was used for, to slide this over. Now that that slides over, that seems to be stuck. Right, it goes back in the hole. I can then slide it over, or I can take this out first, rather, and then slide this up. Okay. Now we're getting somewhere. Now we're getting somewhere. Still that wheel turns and there's no real point to it yet. And this thing comes up and goes down. It's like very loose, so I don't know what to make of it. To maybe then slide something else into it. I really don't know what the next step is here. I don't know why this piece keeps lifting, but I know that it's attached to a piece that uh, has that CR on it, so maybe it slides out somehow. Maybe the wheel has to go up. And why would this move out of the way? The reason this would move out of the way is to reveal like a piece that's in here, but this doesn't seem to move anywhere. I'm just trying to slide pieces around without breaking anything. This looks a little sus here. This part, something going on over here that I have to move. Maybe that has to do with the wheel. Huh, this one's really giving me a run for my money. Hmm, that wheel's just not connecting to anything right now. There's something blocking, whatever's on top is going to sort of rotate with this wheel, but it's being blocked by something and it's something around here. Oh, oh, there we go. CR, oh, wow. Not sure what happened there and not, oh, not sure why it, uh, won't open up again, but we had just uh, we had just solved it somehow. <laughs> All right, that one's pretty cool. I don't know how to get it back to the original state though. 
Pretty cool. A little, uh, a little bit janky though. This one was like felt like it was about to fall apart on me. So there you go. These are all the puzzles that we've solved today. That leaves us with this one. Uh, it's got the little CR here, which is really cool. This is actually the hardest puzzle they own called Stellar. Now all of their configurations are named after sort of star signs. You have Aries, Aquarius, and all this. And this one is Stellar. And this one apparently is the hardest puzzle that they have. Very, very difficult. Um, I'm not going to solve it today, but if you guys would like to see me solve it, go ahead and leave a like or comment below. Um, you can also check out Cheat3's channel. It shows you actually how to build this very one. I have not looked at it yet. I will attempt to solve this on my own time if you guys don't want to see it, but I I think uh, it merits a solve. Let me know what you guys think and uh, head on over to Cheat3's channel. Check out these cool Lego puzzles. Well, hot dang. Ladies and gentlemen, there we have it. We have solved all these tiny little Lego puzzles that are named after star signs. Cheat3 uh, left the link to the channel below. Solve them for yourself or you can go build some or create your own, whatever you want. But Legos are a really cool way to design puzzles, even, even as, as like a mock-up prototype to a puzzle that you want to build. Very cool idea, uh, super fun, and uh, for all ages. <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying anymore. I'm going to get out of here. Guys, like, subscribe, all that stuff. We'll see you on the next one. Peace. Rah.